Robin Air EVDC 100 tester is a device that tests the electronic control valves and a variable displacement AC compressor. It is placed in line between the control valve and the wiring harness connector so valve issues can be diagnosed before condemning a compressor. The kit includes the EVDC 100 tester as well as the EVDC 101 valve harness module that plugs into the wiring coming from the compressor to keep the AC active. There is also a connector adapter whether it's big or small connectors. A positive lead which connects to the positive plus sign on the EVDC 100. A negative cable that connects to the battery negative and to the EVDC 100. There is a valve connection cable that connects to the compressor valve to control the variable displacement. Connect these cables to the EVDC 100, the positive, the negative lead, and the compressor valve lead. Then connect the positive lead to the positive post on the vehicle battery. The negative lead on the negative post of the battery. If connected correctly, when you turn on the unit, a red light will appear. Route the compressor valve lead somewhere through the front of the engine bay to get access to the AC compressor. On this vehicle, we have to remove the covers to have access to the AC compressor. Disconnect the electrical connection for the variable displacement valve on the end of the AC compressor. The wiring end coming from the harness is where we're going to connect the valve harness module. This vehicle has a small new compressor, so I have to use adapter EVDC 102 to make the adaption between the compressor and connect to the EVDC 100. To perform the test, you will need the engine running. To activate the control valve on the compressor, rotate the control knob slowly clockwise from minimum towards maximum to activate and observe the pressure on the high side and the low side of the AC system. If no change in pressure occurs, then the valve or the compressor is defective. If there are changes observed and the suction low side pressure goes down or the high side pressure goes up, the compressor is working properly. Further diagnosis of the AC system upstream from the compressor is recommended to detect the source of the problem. The tester regulates the input signal to the valve to verify the valve's operation.